get started, uh, I would like to know what, where the, that idea came from, just about getting there to make a, an album of yourself like that. Um, good question. I think that when when we when we um, through your favorite enemies, I think that I needed that break. I needed that distance. And as a lot of people, when we talk with a lot of people, and you know when you get to say the same things over and over and over again, even if, if the band is very different from all the other rock and roll band in the matter that, in the sense that, you know, we're, we're, there's a lot of impros and, you know, we, 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 um, we go through those songs in, in different forms and, and different ways. But I think that it, it was time for me also to take a little break, I would say. And, uh, and I wasn't really thinking about doing an album I'm more into writing, mm. you know, so, so I was writing a lot. And when I left for Tanger, it was really f about that, to take, you know, just to take a real break. And I wasn't really in, didn't think about stuff much in terms of career or doing a record or there's no, it's, it's funny because it's a very complex album, yes. but there's absolutely no ambition in the record. So. Well, we kind of... Uh surprisingly discovered it because there was no, nothing like usual, no promotion. It was like announced just a few, almost we can say days ago and uh, no like video, yeah. like not the usual kind of Yeah, that setup, was a way for so. me to say, well, I can back down anytime, you know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. Just like, 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 okay, like, okay. <laughs> it's all right. If I don't feel like it, it's... Yeah, I didn't want, I didn't want to go through that whole thing. And I, I like it. I like doing videos and I, mm. I, I like, you know, everything that goes with releasing an album. But for this, I didn't feel like I had to. I didn't feel like I was into it. And I think it would have been a little um, um, sketchy for me to do it because the album is so, it, it's, it's a different thing. It's a journey. It's not, it's, you know, obviously, I don't think we're gonna hear that on the radio. So, so? And, and because it's not, it's, 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 this is not what it's all mm, about. Absolutely. You know, so I, so I didn't want to go into like trying to give some kind of a perspective and samples, musical samples to the people mm. say, hey, look, you know, I've got a new record coming in. And so I think it, I, and at, at the same time, I didn't want to freak everybody's out about me having a solo record. So for everything that it means, you know, for, and by out of respect for your favorite enemies, fans and family, I didn't want to, to do that, you know, for them to be worried at what's going on. And so, but m it was mainly about me being able to back down, probably. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't talking, I was like, what have I done? What have I done? <laughs> <laughs> I still have time. <laughs> but it's funny you mentioned this because I was in Paris when we announced the record and I had a chance to meet a few mm. friends of ours and they were all like, I think a little bit scared and wondering what's what's going on, and so it, yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm I'm sorry. And um, can you walk us through um, maybe you, how this all came up together, leading to um, just maybe the album title? What what's what's windows in the sky? What does that mean? I think again, it, it's very it's very uh, difficult to give like a, a very uh, short answer to um, to that whole that whole thing, because I've been away for almost two years. Mm. So, mm. and also that, that it, it's been a lot of, um, a lot of things happening, you know, it's just pretty much like all, all the imageries of the ocean and everything. So, so it's very, it's very difficult for me to, to, to give, to, to give a definite answer about stuff that I'm still discovering through the album, because that's the thing I'm writing and, and I don't really think about it after when, when either with this project or with the band, or your favorite enemies, I don't really think uh, much about it after. So, and I think that's, that's how I left for almost two years. I wasn't really thinking about the next step. I wasn't really thinking about what should I do. Uh, so, and it came, it kind of came back naturally as we were reconnecting in mm. the band because for a long time we, we were communicating together, but there was no intention of going back, mm. you know, with, in the midst of your favorite enemies as we knew it. So uh, the way it was before, so because so many things change and, and I think we, we grew also mm. artistically and I was very tired of rock and roll. I wasn't really, uh, wow. yeah, I got sick oh, of it yeah. a, a bit, yeah. 
and and it's very it's 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 weird but it's very tiring we 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 toured a lot we did so many things so many projects of one after another and at one point you get very um kind of get numb mm. you know and you you keep repeating the same things over and over again night after night and it and you'd never want it to become some kind of a gimmick and and you better you better stop before it becomes uh some kind of a job and and then it becomes some kind of a cycle and a lot of people were especially when we did like Tokyo session i was very very happy about the record i think that what we what we did with the record was absolutely beautiful and Definitely. amazing and i was very very happy and I, i felt like when i was in tanger i told myself well that would be like a, like a very cool high note to leave this thing to, just as it is with this yeah exactly yeah. because then you don't if you don't feel it anymore mm. and and you go back into the whole uh cycle of things then you might damage something that you maybe don't understand yet mm. and when you do that i think it's very dangerous because you, then it becomes ambition then through that ambition there's a lot of uh dissatisfaction that comes with it because then it becomes about results about perceptions about being seen a certain way sure and i didn't want to go uh i didn't want to walk that path and so I was way more into writing and i wrote a lot and still do so that that was the background of it and i was so tired and i was so uh i was really damaged i would say and tanger really helped me in that way because just just to be on my own it was crazy for me to go in north, north africa and in such a different setting you know sometimes lo- a life will you know uh guide you in places you would never imagine yourself not only to visit but to stay sure of course and to call in at one point you know you visit it's it's enough of a of a situation that it you know it's wow it's, it's very strange and in in the in the most beautiful way and then you stay for a little bit longer and then it becomes home and and then you don't see much of yourself outside of that uh realm and so that was to the that was where i was uh into mm. emotionally i would say sure and it took it took me two years to get back yeah. to, to get back to the surface yeah and i saw you know we saw maybe it doesn't sound like it with the <laughs> record but this is this is really what it is well uh, definitely sounds like it and we saw well i saw i knew this day at some point would come because over the year over the years you've been through um as we've had the chance to speak about it a little bit last year we've been through so much and it was always put like some kind of a in a place mm-hmm. called maybe the uh, the later drawer yeah we'll deal with it later and they yeah. kind I have, of I have a lot of I have a lot of that like, yeah for sure a lot of these and i was when uh, always Uh, asking you you're sure you want to do this you're sure you want to uh-huh. do that and it was always yeah yeah let's go let's go and at some point when you told me oh, I want to just go want to go to Tangier I feel it's like it's the time mm. you know right now to to do this and now because there's a thing when you when you're when you're within the context of a band you know that's that's some it's not about your decisions mm. sure you know it's not about yeah you're part of it yeah and and you don't want to be the one who's always like uh you don't want to rain on anybody's parade mm, yeah. you know everybody's so into it and everybody's so involved uh, into it so when 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 you're when you're coming and you're saying well you know it's you want to take some time off then you have to think about all the consequences because it's not like you're with your best friends it's a family sure. we're living together yes. there's a lot of things involved and so you say okay well you you, you will i waited as much as i could and at one point before it was too late mm. and, and and it was too damaged to even imagine coming back i had to go and that i think that's the beauty of being in a band on the flip side was that and when your friends was the fact that i really felt like everybody understood that i didn't have to i i, I didn't need to to talk too much about it exactly so exactly. so then it, it it i think that i didn't i didn't ha- um because the, the worst thing would have been for me to leave with guilt mm. on top of everything yeah, else absolutely you know just like to leave and say well okay this is you know that's it it would have been a lot to take sure. at, especially at this point you know yeah and stay together for the kids it's never you know yeah just doesn't lead anywhere 